to. We'll figure it out as it comes up. But either way, I'm gonna have to look over to see view this match at the moment because we do not have the actual gameplay up on the extra monitor. But there we go. Hi, what's up everybody? So right now, I think they're playing their first match. Oh yes, they definitely are. And we have Utopian and Array and the return of Mink. The one only Charizard Legend. Uh, we also have uh, 123 Splatty P on the mime. Oh, wait, we gotta get the. Gotta get those things in. Okay. Um, yeah, so right now. Ooh, so yeah, somebody knocked out the cameras too. But oh, we're gonna have Brand joining us on the mic actually, instead of having a silent mime join us. Unfortunately, Splat is a little sick, I think. That's why I can't speak. Hey guys, it's Brand. Yeah. And. Uh, on the mic. Right now, Charizard versus Rosalina. Not, not something yeah. you're going to see too um, often. Right from the get-go, just the thought of the matchup with a big body like Charizard and Rosalina's. Oh, <laughs> oh it's over. <laughs> All right. And he uh, flare blitzed across the stage. and Oh, that's what it was? Back. Yeah. Oh, no. From when I came by, he was already down to stock, and Utopia was only at 30. Yeah, no, that <laughs> definitely stopped. I'm not sure exactly sure how he took the stock, but, you know. Rosalina's Probably some, some Luma stuff. I don't know. She didn't have rage, so I wouldn't say that. I just so imagine like a down air. I can imagine. Uh, honestly, I don't know what a Utopian would would want to ban because I think they would do well on the same stages. Most likely. I mean, you don't have anything like uh, Duck on Tree anymore, so yeah. he doesn't really have to worry about that. The closest thing he has would be uh, the top Town platform City. in Dreamland, yeah. or town, or town. Yeah, one yeah. of those two. Uh, I, mean, I mean, to be honest, the Rosa does fine on those stages too. So. Exactly, exactly. I mean, if there's just one stage he doesn't like playing on, I'm just only ban that. Oh, it looks like we're going to be going to 75. 75M? <laughs> nice. Yeah, one thing I got to say is um, I, I took a, took a, one of my friends that came down for CEO to Disney Quest, and we played on a Donkey Kong system that had, like, custom stages on it, like the, the old arcade. Oh, yeah. It started off with a really weird uh, 25M where um, basically there was, like, two conveyor belts with platforms on it that you uh -huh. had, like, walk off on, and then it went to the regular 25M, and then they had uh, 75M that wasn't this one. That was it, was, it was janky as hell, but... Nice, okay, let's go back to special. Okay. Oh, oh, my bad. And if I don't disagree with this, I mean, you get another kill to Charizard. Um, I don't know if you're going to want more space as Charizard in this matchup. Um, I really think about it. Like, of course, the, the main thing he wants to do is just get rid of Luma. I'm not really sure what moves Charizard has that can get rid of Luma. Um, down B has super armor, so if he get like that, if yeah, he wants to okay. land with it. Ooh, See, okay, now, now Luma's gone. Yeah, now, now Utopian is a different kind of... He's some kind of monster, so he can probably perform very well without his Luma. Yeah. I mean, you know, definitely yeah, one of the things that Things are already doing a lot better in the last game. He, he did more than 50%. Yeah. Now, yeah, Charizard's back air, incredibly big hitbox, powerful even with the, uh, the weak hit. Ah, uh, so that's unfortunate. I was thinking right there maybe the Ooh. hitbox would get rid of Luma if it had one, but maybe he's going to have to go with, like, down throw to, in order to kind of pass the Luma away. And he's got he's to be careful of Luma's hitboxes, so, like, once Rizal especially back air, once Rosalina doesn't move, Luma does one right after. It's a lot stronger. Yeah, can't camp um, the air like that next to Rosalina. You know, one thing that I just realized that nice. I, didn't, I haven't seen Mink try yet, but probably a good reason he's not doing this. Side beam. Uh, no, not side Oh, nice up, up air getting rid of Luma, too. Ooh, oh, oh, unfortunate that uh, back air is kind of missing. Yeah. I, oh, I, I know. Yeah, I know what he wanted. But Utopian wasn't bite, wasn't a uh, gonna bite. Yeah. No, I mean, you got for that thing. You got to do it more as a reaction. Ooh. So uh, uh, you saw that wind box that Utopian was affected by. Charizard's down tilt of all things has a wind box. So we got like kind of swiveling around there. Yeah. No, you can definitely like suck your. Oh, nice. Up. Calling out a forward smash. Well, the forward air. Yeah. Um. Mink needs to take the stock like now. He's entering very dangerous territory. Oh, okay. questionable. Down smash. Oh, but he's got to watch that Luma though, so you don't want to be anywhere near that. Oh. oh my god. That's it. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, what are, do you know exactly when the armor frames are on that upbeat? Is it just a No up? clue. Okay. I'll, I'll take that. But either way. I'm going to throw out a number and say it starts on frame 5. On frame 5? No, I think. I want to say it has like. No, 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 definitely isn't frame one, because I've knocked him out. Yeah. Um, doing it, so it's definitely going to be something weird. I'm going to find that info out for all you guys. Once again, welcome to CFL SmackDown. 132, I think we're at Yeah, now. That's, I believe it's at 131 or 132. I think, we're, I think it's 132. <coughs> yeah. And this week, Riot's here, but he didn't enter. Oh, really? We got headshot from yeah. uh, uh, Puerto Rico. 
Nasty Samus. Oh yeah, no, he's and we're uh, super blurry. Sure. There, there we okay, go. Okay, you're you're close. It's armor's uh, it, armor frames are four to fifteen. Nice. So I knew it was a long-lasting one. So um, and besides that.